Hello. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate the process of digital signature strengthening. In the theoretical part, we have already said that taking into account the technology of electronic digital signature overlay, without the electronic signature strengthening procedure it is impossible to guarantee about 10 years of legal validity of this signature and it can be declared void in about 2 years. Collecting all paper signature documents is considered analogous to this procedure, that is, when a person signs a contract with his or her signature, theoretically, you should verify that signature with the signature in the person's passport. But this is also not enough, since the passport may be fake and theoretically one would have to go to the Migration Service or the Ministry of Internal Affairs to verify that the passport was issued to that person and such data is in appropriate file. Just the procedure of strengthening is the electronic equivalent of collecting all data at a certain point in time reliable, which guarantee that at this point in time the whole chain of issuance of the passport, the signature of this document existed and the signature imposed on the document using this evidence is legally significant. So we can go back to EDOC. Link and first make sure that the document we signed does not have any long-term data to guarantee about 10 years of storage. We can see it through the line, signature format, which states that the type of this signature is the base one. Note, T, indicates that it has a trusted digital signature creation time. The relevant software created by the European Commission has a section, extend the signature, in which we have to select the already signed document, that is, the main specificity of the strengthening, extension, of the signature is that it can be strengthened by any party, at any time after signing. That is, the strengthening, the collection of documents does not affect the legal significance of the electronic document immediately after signature. The same analog, you sign the contract, but there the bank or legal entity after the signing of the contract begins to collect the facts of proof of the fact that you have a passport, this passport, with this number, with this signature after signing the contract. That is, we choose the document we have signed, the software is quite detailed here, we have the simple ASIC format and the binary CADE signature format and we indicate that we want to strengthen to the long term. Here the letter, L, indicates that it will be a long-term signature, LT, long-term. After the strengthening, extension, we got a document that has the ASICS extension, but as we remember ASIC is a regular zip, we can change the extension, this is not a problem. And this zip archive contains the same file, the same signature visually. But if we re-validate this signature on the EDOC link site, we will see that the signature format already contains the letter L, that is, contains long-term data that will ensure the legal validity of the signature for 10 years. Thank you.